Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, in this video, we are going to talk the how to install TWRP in your Samsung devices, and I am using here the Samsung Galaxy On 7 Pro. So just watch this video till end. This is my On 7, and what you have to do is first let me unlock this. You have to unlock the bootloader. By developer, what you have to do is click five to six times in the build number. This is my build number. Yes, in software info, you will get the build number. Here is the build number, and you can see I am already a developer. And in develop option. You can see you have to enable the OEM unlocking. So you have to uh, means you have to enable it. This will be uh, unlocking your bootloader. If you are not unlocked your bootloader and you are going to install recovery and it will not install and you are having already a recovery and you are going to uh, in that recovery so it will be locked by FRP and I have already locked first time so I have uh, been aware of that so what you have to do is power off this and I'll show you the stock recovery of my all 7 the volume up button power button and the home uh, home button you have to press simultaneously here the it comes and here is your stock recovery so what you have to do just you have to means i have only uh, shown you the how is stock recovery it's not the original one and uh, the you have to install TWRP so you have to uh, download TWRP and before you have uh, then you have to install uh, that Odin for Samsung I will give the link in description and the Samsung drivers uh, should be installed if it is not installed uh, then your desktop will not find the device so you have to uh, now go in download mode so that you can put it and flash uh, the TWRP from Odin. This is you have to do volume down, power button, and the home screen button simultaneously to go in the download mode. So, this is the download mode. As you can see, you have to why this is not focusing. This is the download mode. You have to click volume up to continue. Yes, you can see now. This is the downloading mode and you have to just this your uh, micro USB cable USB cable and joint fitting computer and what you have to do is open Odin just a second guys And here the USB driver that you have to install, here is Odin and here is the TWRP. So open Odin and you can see that here is here the FRP lock is off. Means when you enable OEM unlock, the FRP lock is off. If you are not then here the FRP lock is on, it shown and it will it will not install your TWRP and you have to click here AP you can see AP loading and select the file
Watch that for the fight. Good fun. And your double point start. Beautiful. This, this you can now. So on seven pro, my is booting up. I will power off and see that if it is in front or not. Here you can see the recovery. There he is. Now we have installed the TWRP and this is telling that TWRP leave the system partition unmodified to make it easier for you to take official updates. TWRP will be unable to prevent the stock room from replacing TWRP and will not offer to root your device. So yes, you have to just swipe it to allow modification and yes. It is the TWRP Team Win Recovery Project, and you have now flash it through OD, and now you can flash custom ROMs and you can root your Samsung devices. As the Samsung devices are not enabling them uh, to install root apps like King Root or something to root the device, so just uh, you have to flash Super Su file for rooting your device. And as soon as possible, I will show the custom room for Samsung devices. Thank you for watching this video and subscribe for more videos like this. I will as soon as make the custom rooms videos on On7 and on OnePlus One devices. Thank you guys. Sign in.